Do you like pizza? Well, you've come to the right place because today we're opening Emerald's Pizza Parlor. So, basically, I need to learn to make pizza first. So, I have some ingredients in here that I think might be useful. Um, I'm not sure though. So, so I'm going to use each of these ingredients and see if I can make something that might taste pretty good. I want to learn to make pizza, but I need to find out how to make the ingredients first. So, first thing we've got here is a tomato. A tomato can be crafted using four blocks of redstone. A piece of cheese can be crafted using a simple milk bucket in a crafting table. An olive. An olive can be crafted by melting a lapis lazuli block in a, in a furnace, and it'll give me the olive. A sausage can be crafted using a cooked chicken, a cooked rabbit, a cooked mutton, a cooked pork chop, and a cooked steak. Well, obviously a cooked steak in a crafting table. And of course, a piece of bread, three wheat. Uh, a pepperoni can be got by smelting a block of redstone in a furnace. And a pineapple can be got by smelting a block of gold in the furnace. And a pepper can be got by crafting four emeralds around one flint and steel. And a piece of bacon can be crafted by using three pieces of pepperoni, which we already covered, over here. So, we're going to grab each one of these, and uh, we're going to see if we can make a nice pizza. Now, I feel like I might need this as well. I don't know why. I just got a feeling. Uh, we're going to grab these too. Okay. Perfect. Let's throw this on here. This is my chef's garments, by the way. This is what I, I'm using to cook in, because I don't really have a chef uh, kind of suit yet. Or wait, what do you call it? A chef? Wait, what do you call the stuff the chefs wear? Anyway, moving on. So, yeah, I've got this. Uh, let's put the bow in the thing and uh, golden apples. Yeah, perfect. Okay, so let's let's make some pizza, all right? Let's see if we can make some pizza here. So, I'm going to combine all of these things into this crafting table, and um, hopefully we get an amazing, tasty pizza. Oh, there we go. A pizza. But it says this might be more than just a tasty treat. Okay, let's get the pizza and see. Okay. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, so apparently all this stuff attacks you. So, if you didn't know by now, this is a showcase on the Pizza Boss mod. This is a mod I found, I thought it looked interesting, so I said I'd give it a go. So basically, the whole thing of this mod is you gotta craft the pizza and fight the pizza. Now, um, these are all these little minions, all these like ingredients. We've got pieces of pepperoni, olives, and those little sausages chasing me around. Um, so, yeah, those are the minions, and this is the main Pizza Boss over here. Um, I think he does a lot of damage, I'm not sure. Oh yeah, he does. Okay, let's eat some golden apples real quick. Um, the Pizza Boss may be drowning, I don't know. Um, very possibly, very possible he is. So let's kill all these things really quick because because he's gonna keep spawning them, I think. Um, and it's just, oh my god. Okay, I did not realize that happened. So let's just keep. I think that was the olives that blow up. Not gonna lie. And um, wow, they actually have a lot of HP for like minions. Okay, let's just come on. Stop. Get away. Really quickly, I just wanted to say that I'm recording this video a few days after I recorded the last part, so that's why my skin is different and I have a different name. If you haven't seen that video, you should totally go check it out. Um, basically, I changed my Minecraft account name for the first time in four years, and I changed the skin too. So yeah, just quick update, just because in case you're wondering, wait, why did he switch his skin and why is his name different? This is why, okay? I changed everything a few days ago, so go watch that video first and you'll understand. But yeah, that's the basic concept of this pizza mod anyway. It just literally spawns this boss here, and the hardest part isn't even killing the boss, it's getting through his minions because he spawns so many of them that they literally just, you know, take over the entire screen and you can't even hit him. So we're actually just going to kill him in creative mode because every time I hit him, he spawns more minions and you can't even find him. Look how many minions there. Like, they just like, oh my god, how are you supposed to get through all these just to get to him? That's insane. But we're going to just keep going for him here. Oh my god. What the heck? Okay. And there we go. Alright, so did they just, oh no, he dropped diamonds. Okay, sweet. So yeah. Um, it's very difficult to kill him because he spawns this many minions when you fight him every time you hit him, which is kind of ridiculous, uh, but that's basically the pizza boss mod, and there's a lot of minions now I have to clean up afterwards, so that's gonna be fun. So, it's, you, you basically, you're doing all that for two diamonds. I don't know if it's worth it or not, but hey, completely up to you, man. If you want a challenge, then there you go, there's the pizza boss. But anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy that quick little showcase on the Pizza Boss mod. If you want to go check it out, it's down in the description of the video. And um, yeah, if you want to have a nice little boss to fight in your Minecraft world, then I'd highly recommend it. And just good luck is all I'm saying because he spawns so many minions. <laughs> but that'll do for this one. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you did enjoy. Um, make sure to leave a like on the video if you did enjoy. And um, make sure to subscribe if you're brand new to the channel. Thank you again so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Take care.